can't be at the end of the bench sulking. You can't be unprepared. You got to be ready to step in and prove your worth to your ball club. Monty elaborating on the value of Frank Kaminsky after yesterday's win. He just said, and I can't even imagine where we'd be without Frank as Booker goes on the attack game yesterday, on the attack that time, but won't get the foul call. That was after Okoro had hit the pull-up three and Sexton racing down and hits the quick two. Just keep him out there and make him shoot jump shots and not allow him to get to the rim. Moore takes the handoff, finds a cutting, Mikhail Bridges. And elevated, he's got probably half his arm over the rim, just like that right there. He's yeah. got to throw it up. Breaking out of that funk on the three-point line yesterday. And you can see, nice job by Okoro sprinting down the floor. Tough drive, D.A. with the offensive glass. Good ball movement, reset to D.A. Hammers it home. Well, I like that. You mentioned they started out 3-0, but they have hit the skids lately as D.A. Great recovery, gets the block, sets up the break. Bridges with a hammer. Javon Carter making his first appearance here. His sons breaking into a little zone defense coming out of that timeout. Starts are tough. Sons very short-handed here tonight. If you're just joining us late, his socks Sexton with a little runner. This is good. Booker with a little dribble hesitation gets inside on Torian Brents. Yeah, went right at him. Didn't give him a chance to relax at all. Drummond is relentless, man. He chases everything. So, great block out. This guy's got three 20-20 games on the season. Mikhail Bridges. Run him off the three. That long limp. You're not going to block a shot. <laughs> That's funny, EJ. You know, you, you see him hit those shots, and it's almost like he's like Booker, Carter, and Aiton. Shot clock at two. Book's got to take the tough contested step back three and gets the rainbow connection. Over the last few years, championship team three the last four years, and Book brings the boom. Suns will have plenty of time to work for the final shot. That was point guard skills of back in play, right? Just watching Chris Paul, then last year playing with Ricky Rubio. That has been extremely impactful for that guy right there. He's got the chef hat on here in the opening quarter. Galloway comes up with a steal. Final seconds. Fires on the baseline and got it. Uh, it just is a tremendous feeling, and you can feel the energy really soaking up with this team. Windler, tough step back three over Kaminsky. Frank plays with a lot of confidence. When his confidence is high, his numbers really pick up all around. Long rebound to Prince. Prince finds a little lane. It, well, he's a guy that'll go on the attack. Not much defense being played right now. I mean, both teams shooting the ball very well. Prince got seven points in his nine minutes off the bench. Kaminsky inside, gets the finish and the foul. As they go for sixth win in the last seven games. Is even more pride and accountability on the defensive end is Windler. So when he goes in there and does that, it's, it's shocking. Nice backdoor cut by Bridges, gets the feed. And we'll get a foul. <laughs> Let me build you up, man. Me and The Rock haven't been working out too often. Bridges brings the boom. Mikhail was able to knock down four threes. And I asked, you know, wonder when the fanning of the flames is going to come back as yeah. Drummond gets the alley-oop. But, but Frank addressed it afterward. Moving in on five minutes to go here in the first half. Here's Prince. On a baseline pull up, and Torian Prince had 58 straight back in the 16 17 season. Feeding up top, Allen gives it a home. But again, he threw it up so high, I know we're thinking, is he going to get it? And yet he does. Cam on the drive with the Cam slam. Just want to see him do it more, and I think him running him off that line. I just want to see Cam continue to do that because he has a little bit more athleticism, I believe, than McKell. Uh, another feed up top for Trump. Bench works across, gets right to the rim. Uh, I mean, you can go in there and feel good about getting 62, but you allowed the Cavs, who only score 103, to get 60 plus.
Booker with the alley, D.A. with the oop. Thought our group did a great job getting rebound assists as Booker with a pull-up won't get it, but D.A. able to keep it alive and chase it down. And that's D.A.'s bucket right there. That's his bucket. Allen getting his second start in the Cavaliers uniform and just using that long arm to take it over commit. Book just backing down using that strength. Yeah, that shows the touch. That's what you call right there. Book are able to sneak inside, but pass a little bit high. Stays with it. <laughs> Book. You got to go at these little guards. I mean, that's what the Suns are doing now. Sexton sees an opening, goes glass. He's like a machine, man. What's that? Can we participate in that? I think we should be able to. No, oh, tough tip in there in traffic by Drummond. Makes it a one-point game. Cavs led by five early. Here's a lob up top. D.A. with a finish. With team rebounding. Cam on the catch and shoot. Step back 3-0. No. Jones, yeah, Jones is going to have to play. I mean, you know, he's going to have to be ready to play in that regard. Big offensive. Cam has it stripped. Yeah, he was he was thinking about giving the ball back to DeAndre, and because of that, lost his aggressiveness and driving, which makes you vulnerable to a guy taking it away from you. And Drummond shows off his guard skills. Now we're tied up at 85, just the fourth tie. More on a tough turn and spin. Yes. Chance for the Cavs to take their first lead since way back in the first. Might get a couple of seconds to get a good look. Merlin puts it on the floor on the attack. He tried a little back tap, but nobody there to gather except for Cleveland. Javale McGee runs the floor, gets the payoff pack. Their three-point attempts have really been cut down over the last three games. McGee just muscles it away from Cam Johnson. He's too long. We'll see if this... Suns team can continue to dig in defensively. Dotson regathers, sets it up inside for Jared Allen, who bobbled it, but was able to hang on to it long enough and draw the foul of Dylan Windler. Yeah. Was able to get on top of it and get a piece. Normally doesn't happen to Devin in that sense. Here's Dotson with a tough pull-up. Damian Dotson. And almost coughed it up again. Book slips a pass out to Moore. Sets and fires the three. Big three-point hit from Etwan Moore. Trying to get reset. They don't have their bigs on the floor right now, with the exception of Allen and Cam. The fight to the Suns tonight is Drummond pushes them back in front by one. But for the most part, throughout the course of the year, you can pick on three games, but they're 10 and 14, and they have really. The Suns got to close this out, uh, K. Ray, with with this on this end right here. The scoring is not an issue right now. Book rising up for the three. That's the one weapon of choice that's gone for them here in the fourth quarter. Drummond stay on the floor here for Bickerstaff's Cavaliers. Sexton trying to turn the corner. Just muscles his way down the lane to the rim. Gets the finish in the foul. Put his head down and become a malcontent. Stay ready. And now look at the production. As we've said, he is a pro's pro. As Booker looking inside, fading to his right. It's got a... Busted on McHale because he missed a couple of opportunities on custom the basket. His book on the tough turnaround over Orcora. And it's really a smooth 35. It, well, it is. 17 in the first. Orcora behind the strike. Booker trying to find some space to operate. Draws the double team. Slips it past the DA. Swings it out to the open shooter. Cam Johnson registers the three point hit. And while offensively there was a lot of beauty to it. Defensively, not so much, but you make the plays down the stretch to get a much-needed